Gary on the right. Gary Smith from Florida Town Dean. Congratulations. Uh, have you ever jumped that high on a football field? Did you do with that I used to have in high school. That's like the first clip on my huddle. Like he jumped over somebody. And I had ran over another kid, but I didn't know I had hit him that bad. But uh, yeah, I have before, but it was a senior high school, so. Okay. And, and before that, you, you did you not realize you, you had stepped out of bounds or were you kind of afraid you might have? Uh, what? I didn't think I did, but because uh, like when I caught the ball and I turned, I looked at him and then I was like, all right, I'm by him. But I didn't think I went out of bounds. So like when he, he called me out of bounds, I kind of got mad. I wanted that to be in a sports center. Okay. And, uh, and finally, just, just comment on, on the, uh, you know, you guys haven't played since the AC Championship game. I mean, uh, everybody's, sometimes there's a little rust there, but do you think, how do you think the offense was able to perform at such a high level from the first drive? Uh, I mean, you know, after the ACC Championship, we had uh, made a decision, you know, uh, we got to come in and win this ball game. So I think, um, you know, just keeping up with the, the pace of the game, the pace of our offense as well. Uh, you know, while we're you know, away from football for three weeks, uh, you know, I mean, the leaders, you know, they kept us uh, straight, you know, when it came to us preparing for this game, you know, with all the COVID and stuff like that. So, um, yeah, I mean, we just, Moved on from the game. You know, we just came in, came to the ACC uh, after the ACC championship, came to this bowl game, and you know, we made the plan. You know, we just gotta finish out. Connor, go ahead. Connor, then you pass it Essex. AT, hey, what was the feeling of from eight days ago when it looked like this game might not get played to being able to get out there and, and play another game and kind of put the whatever sting was left in the ACC championship behind you? Um, I mean, I kind of wanted to, I wanted to play so bad, you know, just just to finish out with the seniors, you know. Um, I never had a bond with a team like this before. So, you know, I knew how important it was to them. And I made a, a promise to myself, you know, that I'm going to finish it out with these boys, so. Three more, Essex. AT Essex there with the old bull and black. Um, what does it mean, just can you speak a little upon having Sam this season and how he's played throughout the season and in this game, and then what it means to the program that he's coming back next year? Uh, to me, um, you know, we actually uh, worked really hard together this summer. You know, I made it the goal, you know, just to get with him, you know, go over the offense, go over the coverages, uh, you know, going in the indoor, passing the ball. So that was my goal, you know, um, just to get with him and stuff like that. And uh, as a team for next year, uh, you know, it's all I got to say, we're going to do way better than this year. You know, so uh, not no cockiness, you know, just just confident in these, in these guys, you know, just what we have and what we produce this year. We're going we gonna to be really, really good next year. Okay, go ahead. Uh, AT, uh, was there, a, what point of the season did the light come on for you? And was there a little bit of extra motivation playing in Florida? Mm -hmm. uh, yes, there was extra motivation playing in Florida. You know, uh, just coming back uh, to the state. You know, I ain't really been here in so long. You know, just coming back here and putting on a show for the, uh, for the people back at home, you know, it's a, uh, it's actually exciting and it's fun. You know, I just stepped on the field and I was like, ah, I'm home. It's time to go crazy, so. Uh. All right, Andrew, last one. Okay. Andrew, All right, Andrew Snorton, Stats Network, Atlanta, Georgia. Obviously, congratulations on today. Speak to the individual and collective growth this year as it ties with that bigger theme of good to great. Um, you know, with me, uh, that was our. That was kind of my goal too, of being great. You know, be, just not with football, but just being great in everything I do. You know, whether it's coming to school, uh, you know, just football itself. You know, outside of school, you know, with family stuff like that. That was my goal for me to be great. So you know, when I heard that our lingo was good to great, I was like, this is a sign. This team will be really good. So um, you know, just for just for me, uh, I just told myself, you know, I got to be great with this, you know, just when it comes to steps and catching the ball, stuff like that. So, uh, 
you know, the theme, it, it was kind of creepy, you know, just telling myself I want to be great and everything, and then we had the link on good to great, uh, but um, I knew this team was special, though, so. Thanks, AT. Appreciate it. Chat, come on now.